We have Shakespeare's friends, John Hemmings and Henry Condell, to thank for publishing his plays in an impressive volume now known as the First Folio, printed as a tribute to him seven years after he died. They ordered the work by genre, but Shakespeare always wrote groundbreaking plays that challenged classifications. All of his comedies contain tragic undertones, all of his tragedies comic elements, some of his historical dramas are shaped as tragedies. It would have been far more helpful if Hemmings and Condell had printed the plays chronologically, because scholars still cannot agree about the order in which Shakespeare produced the works. The Two Gentlemen of Verona is thought to be Shakespeare's earliest single-authored play, in which we can see his emerging techniques of characterization, stagecraft and poetic expression. Its ending, like many of Shakespeare's plays, is problematic and involves an attempted rape and murder just moments before two couples apparently live happily ever after. But no approach to Shakespeare is complete without engaging with the wit, eroticism, violence, lyricism, high emotion and often densely intellectual thought to be found in his wider poetic output.